Hey everyone, I'm for the Vault here. Welcome back to more Jurassic World Evolution. We're gonna go ahead and just jump right back in, but before we do, just wanted to say real quick thank you so much to the publisher for giving me a copy of this game so I could play it for you all. I'm having way too much fun, and I'm not gonna lie, I don't want to stop playing it. So let's go ahead and get back into it. I'll see you guys back in just a sec. <laughs> this is Lambert, head of security. Yours, theirs, and mine. Welcome to the islands. So here's our basic conundrum. We want to keep our animals under control while simultaneously encouraging instinctive behaviors because these animals have potential as combatants. Look, everyone's fear object, myself included, is to have these animals running free and loose in the park. But we can't exploit them globally without taking some chances. When you use the word exploit. Oh... That's when you know you're the baddie. We need to keep looking for other dinosaurs we may be able to domesticate. Well, more accurately, put on the road to domestication. The way we'll be able to control them is by letting them control themselves, their natural hierarchy. That means we need more samples. This expedition can help. Cool. Not one of the Chris's. Um, okay, that just barely touches that. But it seemed to have worked. Okay. It makes me wonder if he was just like, no, I'm not going to do another Jurassic Park thing. Because, like, I would think if the game came out, I would want my voice in the game. I wouldn't want anybody else to do my voice. Then again, I'm also someone who loves video games, so maybe, maybe I'm a little different. Okay. Sweet. Okay, so we connected it, I think. No, we didn't. But we connected it to everything else. So that's good. There we go. Mm -hmm. I have to say, they're really nice in the way they let you just build things, which is fantastic. Okay, so this is a pretty small area still. I don't think it's appropriate for a Triceratops, which is what we're supposed to be doing. Um, we definitely need a better area for a Triceratops. I just don't think that that's large enough. I could be wrong though. Um, we don't want them to like breed or anything, so I only need one. Um, so I guess we're gonna incubate this thing. All right. So let's get back into our sciency stuff. Expeditions. So we'll send a crew out. We're sending them to Kanata. Yep, that's that's what that's called, Kanata. Canada. Okay. I know there's something about our home and native land, but that's the only other part I know of that song, so I apologize. <laughs> okay. Increasing the variety. Yeah, I'm I'm aware of that. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I don't really have anything right now. <laughs> What's landscaping? Oh, okay. Vibrant. Vibrant. Okay, throw some vibrant stuff down. What does that even mean? Oh, just some cool flowers and stuff? I mean, I'm all for that. Okay. Sorry, this is gonna make somebody dizzy if it doesn't make me dizzy. I'm sorry. I can already think of one person I know would get dizzy from this, so I'm very sorry. Alright, I feel like we need two because it would be boring if we only had one, so we'll make two. We are running out of money already, look at that. I told you, I, I'm just so good at wasting money. <laughs> I am so good at wasting money. Okay, so emergency shelter provides the island's guests with protection from storms and escaped dinosaurs. Wow, okay, we're building that right there just in case. I don't think the Triceratops will be much of a problem, but just in case. Oh my gosh, look at that guy. Hi, buddy! Oh, look how cute he is! She is. She is. It's Jurassic Park, everything's female. Which is the dumbest idea. Our new specimens, sorry, dinosaurs, are meeting expectations, but we want them to thrive. That's your next assignment. 
making sure our specimens are properly cared for. In other words, dinosaur welfare. The difference with dinosaurs is that they have no point of reference to understand humans, so don't expect much in the way of thank yous. <laughs> I wasn't, don't worry. Um, okay, let's check out these fossils. Extract some DNA. Okay, sell that. Uh, extract that, I suppose. And by the end of this, we Shade should have more shelter from the storm. Either way, that's a win for you and our guests. Okay, so I think that shelter I built helped out, which is good. I like that. Um, but that means we have another expedition we can do. So let's send them to. We already have a Triceratops, I guess, so we'll do that. And we already have the Struthus Sushushushbuka as well, but new viable genome. Ceratorus. Okay, Ceratorus. I don't know how to say half of these. Okay, there we go. Construct small herbivore feeder. Okay, so now I need to build a feeder. I see you've hatched a Triceratops. It might be cute now, but that's only gonna last for about a week. Uh, okay. What is that supposed to mean? Okay, too close. Oh. Oh, okay. I've been monitoring what you've been up to with great interest, and I'm a little disappointed that Dr. Dua came to you for this assignment instead of bringing me into the loop as she should have done. I'll discuss this with her later. Good for you. Jeez. Woo. Little testy, are we? I'm just jealous because I'm so cool. Okay. I wanted to put this next to the feeder. Because I know at least when I've worked with animals in parks, everyone wants to see them eat. Because eating is more fun. Okay, construct an operational ranger station, incubate, and release a triceratops with a 70% genome. Ah, oh, shoot. Well, I've already, like, made two triceratops. Um, that's probably not good, right? So what do I do? Do I do something with the dinosaurs? <laughs> ah, if I've made too many? Don't look at this as extra work. Look at it as extra money and experience. Okay, got a contract for for Pterosaurus. Okay. I'm just accepting everything and I hope that that's not a bad thing. Um, okay, I'll look at that later. Control room. Okay, this is what we want. Um, we're definitely not making a ton of money right now. Okay, expedition map. So I don't have a dig team right now, but they are returning, so I will have one very shortly. In fact, it might already be updating. I don't know if it'll update while I'm watching it, though. Okay. I don't think it would have. You rose to the challenge. That takes commitment. Lambert here. I've got a new assignment that I think is perfect for your skill set. Give it a once over, then let me know if you're interested. Okay, so. Wait, what? Okay. Okay, so now we have our dick team back. Um, Glad to have you on board. As you can imagine, the animals in the various facilities are constantly probing for weaknesses in our security systems. They're smarter and more devious than people give them credit for. Oh my gosh. But I refuse to underestimate their capabilities. That's why I'm always testing and evaluating our security protocols and barriers. And this is where you come in. I've got to give this guy Lambert his due. He actually sees these animals as both opportunity and threat. I don't know if I want to give him his due on that. I, 
That was my biggest complaint, I guess, about... I need you to extract enough DNA from fossils to incubate and hatch a dinosaur. This is the first phase of this mission. Carry on. Okay. Um... Can I, like, look at these and see... Oh. Okay. So, you've got dinosaurs your guests want to get up close and personal with? The thing is, they can't. Construct facilities to increase visibility and keep visitors the right side of the safety glass. I know how this ends. I've seen the movie and I've had a real life. All right, so... Oh, oh, okay. Viewing galleries. Okay, so you can use different things. Gotcha, okay. Um... Got it. There is so much going on in here. Okay. Uh... But then I would also have to actually make other paths. Got it. Okay. I think I'm getting kind of the hang of it so far. I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like this... This isn't as hard as I originally thought it would be. It looks like you've run out of power. That's not good. Build more power stations or increase your output. Okay. How do I increase my output? Um... How? Wait a minute. How do I do that? I probably have to build another... little thing, right? Small power station? Oh, crap! I spent so much money! Okay, so I can probably put a substation, though. I mean, that'll be... See, there's just no power, period, for you to tap into. Okay. Low health. Okay, a little confused what that means. I'm Claire Deering, and I've been on these islands before. On Isla Nublar, I made some mistakes, and I've tried to set them right. I believe in what we're doing, and I believe in these dinosaurs. Okay. Okay, so now I give you the fossils. Um... You must take care of your dinosaurs. Their health is of vital importance. Okay, I understand, but what do I do? <laughs> Whose health is bad? Your health isn't great. But is it because... Do you guys not have a feeder? Oh, oh, here we go, here we go. My advice? Keep your animals well fed. Especially in situations like this. Got it. Okay. So you probably don't even have a feeder. Because I didn't realize that you were all going to need those. Um, which is probably really stupid right now. So ground herbivore feeder. Let's throw one there, and then we'll throw one over here. Okay, next you'll need to incubate my... the animal in a Hammond Creation Laboratory before releasing and housing it in an enclosure. You'll also want to make sure we've got an ACU presence on this island. Okay. Like us, different dinosaurs require different diets. Make sure to place the correct type of feeder in an enclosure. I'm a red meat man myself. <laughs> I don't know why I dislike you so much, Cabot, but I do. Okay. So that'll help. That'll help keep that dinosaur healthy or whatever. Okay. My question, though, is money is an issue. Um, cause we don't have much of it. And I am about to spend what little we have left. Um. Healed by ranger teams. So that's one thing I don't have yet is a ranger team. But I also don't 
No one's like, I have the money for that. Um, also, that's not going to be... Did we just get a little bit of money? I think we did. Okay. Unused power five. Okay, so that should help that. Um, so we need a ranger station so that we can heal up our friends here. Oh, shoot, okay. So that's a lot of money. Um, so in the meantime, maybe we just chill um, and wait, spend, send out expeditions and stuff. Um, come on. I feel bad because I have a dinosaur that needs attention, but there's also nothing I can do right now. Ooh, okay. I mean, right now people are kind of lucky that they're even seeing dinosaurs, so chillax, y'all. Okay. Incubate the Edmontosaurus. I want to see, is that a... I do not know my dinosaurs. Okay, yes, it's another Vigi. It's another herbivore, so we could put it in with our other critters. Okay. Well, I can't build anything until later. And we don't have the ability to, like, make this go faster, do we? Or... I guess I'm thinking, like, we don't have the ability to, like, speed it up, right? Financial security is almost as important as personal security. So take this contract. Okay. Um, at some point, I guess, uh, I really need money, though, because I spent a lot. <laughs> Surprise! I spent a lot of money. Is it? A no, it's not free to incubate them. I was going to say, like, bitch, it's not free to incubate. And the research costs money, too, so I don't even know why I'm going in there. Okay, well, I guess in the meantime... We can just kind of have some fun watching the critters. I think we're just literally going to have to wait for time to pass. Oh, this has no power? Oh, what the hell? Okay, hold on. I need to build another one of those substations then. I do have a little bit more money now. Or not substations. Yeah, substations. Wow, am I, am I crazy or what? Okay. Can I build it? here and then build the pylons into it seems like a mistake to build the pylons into the dinosaur area but I guess I don't really have a choice we really need that ranger building but okay let's see are we can we maybe I mean, okay, let's extract the DNA on that one, but let's sell this one. Oh, I should have sent out another. I think it costs money, though, to send out research teams. Okay, it looks like I have a building that has no power. So, I mean, I still have problems partially depleted. Um, well, we'll go back there, because that'll give us the most bang for our buck. Now you still don't have power? I don't understand though. I gave you power here. Hmm. I must not have done it correctly or we just don't have enough power. And I'm too dumb to understand how this works. Because it says unused power. Um. Okay. The thing is you can't like upgrade it. So I guess what I have to do is research the upgrade? Maybe that's what I need to do. Okay, so we'll go to upgrade and then 
building upgrades. Um, power upgrades. Research. Improved output 1.0. Outage protection. Reduced upkeep. So this is what we need. It's going to cost us a hundred thousand dollars. That's like all the money we have right now. Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. So I think in the meantime, what we have to do is basically just wait for that to upgrade. And then from there, hopefully we can move on a little. I, it's good. This is not going to be easy. Um, once that finishes, we can go ahead and have more power output, but I'm going to literally have to wait to rebuild our cash reserves. We just don't have that much money. So I have a feeling this is going to be a lot of hurry up and wait, because I don't see a way to make the game time change or go faster or anything like that. Although I keep wanting to. I keep trying to click like buttons that work in other games. Um, yeah, I don't know. Plus it says we need three minutes. Let's see, we need three minutes for this research, is that right? Yeah, so we're still at another two minutes. So gift shop. Um, expense, sell for six. Can I sell it for more? Eight. Yeah. Okay. That's it? Are we only selling lunch boxes? Oh, Barbasol. Why are we selling it for less? That makes no sense. Huh. Okay, wait, hold on. Oh, do we have to sell them all for the same price? Oh, I see. We're choosing what it sells. Got you. I felt so stupid right there. Okay. So we're going to sell just the one thing. Got it. For $10. Got it. Okay. I feel like a right moron right now. All right. So I do have $100,000 and I know I need to make one of these things, but it's too expensive. We also need $400,000 to build the other thing. So I guess we're just going to have to sit and wait. But I don't want to make you guys like wait with me. So less than a minute remaining. Okay, good. We have some fossils. So at least we could sell these, hopefully. Um, I mean, it'll help us a little bit, but we can always get new ones, I'm hoping. I mean, we really need the money. So hopefully that'll work. Um, let's check that research. It should be near done. Okay, less than a minute. And then let's go on the expedition map. Partially depleted. Let's send them there again. Um, I know it costs a lot of money, but I mean, it does help us sell things. Or get things to sell, I guess I should say. Although I probably should have looked and saw how much it was really worth it. Wait a minute, that says zero percent. Or zero... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. When we wait, have I power problems, bad things tend to happen. I'd prefer they didn't. So how about making sure your buildings have the power they need? Okay, I just did. I just did. I'm sorry. Okay, modify and release uh, Dracorex with a lifespan. This contract can 95. really help our bottom line. I mean, these aren't timed or anything, so we can just like leave them, right? Because I'm fine with just leaving it there and hoping it happens. Um, I don't see a reason why not to. Let's do this. Um, even though we probably should really save that money for other things. Do we can't sell the dinosaurs? Could you imagine the money we can make? Mm -hmm. Okay. Current sale value. Wait, so we can sell them. How do I sell a dinosaur? If I want to sell a dinosaur, how do I do that? I mean, I'm a hundred percent okay with selling my dinosaurs. Uh, 
I would enjoy that, actually. If I could just, like, breed them and... Whoa, 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 hold on. Our fences are not electrified. Oh. Well, that seems good. Okay. My dog just flapped his ears and it scared me for a second. 97 grand. I mean, for 97 grand, I would sell the thing. Come on. Okay. So I think what we're going to have to do, I'll come back. I'll go ahead and pause the recording and I'll come back once there's actually something going on because I, I know this is going to take me a while to like get some stuff and we're going to have to take a while to get some money too. So what we'll do is we'll do that and then I will be back in just a sec. Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching me play Jurassic World Evolution. Of course, shout out to the publisher who gave me a copy of this so I could play it for you. Again, we are playing over on Switch. This was definitely on other things when it first came out. I know it was on PlayStation 4. I wanted to play it, but this is the Switch version and it is so awesome. I'm having so much fun. So we're gonna go ahead and get out of here, guys. It is the end of this video, but before we do, if you could like, comment, subscribe, do all the YouTube things if you like this video, please let me know if you wanna see more of Jurassic World Evolution. And also, if you'd like to go ahead and check out more of my videos, there should be some on the screen there. You can also click that picture of my big dumb head that will subscribe you to the channel. If you click that, you can also click on that bell icon. Be notified every time I post a brand new video. The last thing that's on your screen there are some Patreon members. Those are my patrons, the people who keep this channel running. If you would love to go and say hi to them over on Twitter, right now those are all Twitter handles. I would appreciate it so much. If you'd like to become a patron, there is information on the screen too in the lower left in that box. But otherwise, please tell my patrons how awesome they are and how much we appreciate them. Thank you so much. We're going to go ahead and get out of here, but I'll see you in the next one.